If I were to ask you to name what you think the best city in Canada to live in is, you would say... Halifax. Huntsville, Canada. Ontario. Are you from Huntsville? I am. <laughs> For me, because I just moved here to Toronto. I would pick Montreal. Okay. Yeah, Why? I think so. I don't know. Born and raised there. Most people have a soft spot for where they live, but how do their cities stack up against hundreds of others across Canada? Money Sense out with their best places to live issue, and there's a clear winner. Number one, second year in a row is Ottawa, our nation's capital. It's, uh, you know, it's, it's a community that a lot of people don't really give it full credit for, for just how strong it is. It has low, low unemployment. Those are two really key factors. Once you get those things out of the way, everything gets a little bit easier. The report taking into account 36 different criteria, everything from economy to culture, health care to crime. And this year, the number of communities doubling from previous years, 417 across the country. And our nation's capital, still sitting on top. It's uh, something I take with a great sense of pride as mayor. We used to be, you know, sort of viewed as a bit of the, the, the old expression, the city that fun forgot. It's completely changed now. Lots of employment opportunities. It's probably one of the places for myself where I can find uh, places to work all over. Rounding out the top 10 cities in Quebec, BC, Saskatchewan and Alberta, with only one other in Ontario, Burlington. Burlington has been in her top 10 for, for a number of years now. Burlington is in that sweet spot. It can tap into the Hamilton economy. It can tap into Toronto. It's on a goal line. So how did Toronto do? Last year, overall, we ranked number 43. This year, 129. Now, taking into consideration all the new communities that were added this year, still not that bad, sitting in about the 25th percentile. But one list that we ranked very high on may surprise you. You wouldn't really think of Toronto as a place to retire, so why is it so popular? We're looking at uh, access to healthcare, uh, you know, proximity to airports, a strong arts and culture community. Yes, it's a little bit more expensive, but you're, you know, in retirement you might actually get a little bit more uh, for that money if you're able to afford it. Burlington and Oakville sitting in the top five when just looking at Ontario cities and both ranking high for places to raise kids in Canada. We look at daycare prices. It's a little bit cheaper than is in, in Toronto as well. When you put those things together, uh, plus high incomes uh, and, and so forth, it makes it a really good place to raise a family. If you don't agree with some of the rankings, new this year, a feature that allows you to create your own list according to criteria that matters to you. Check out moneysense.ca. Melanie Ng, City News.